Ugh. Reese Rappleton with Reality Bites video vlog. Oh, that woman. Oh, that turn my hair out. Lauren Harry's. Yes, as you know, we was on the Joe McHale show last week. The celebrity one. <laughs> Just have to get that one in. <laughs> um, Lauren opened the show up, going on about the nightmare holiday from Benny Dorm that she had with me. And she was waffling on about, I demand to see her topless. And I walked around naked. And I ate her avocados and she went on and on and on and on. And do you know what? I was that fuming backstage. That, that fuming. And that wound up. Blood pressure was up there. My heartbeat was going like that. I was so annoyed. I thought, I'm going to go out there and just completely kick off. And I had to really calm down. My head was spinning with everything that she was saying. And when I went out there, you just don't get the chance to say everything you want to say. Or the bits I did say, some of it didn't get shown. Because you've got Jezza at it, you've got Lauren at it. Have you got Hey, what? Like, ooh, ooh, manny, ooh, ooh, ooh. Blah, 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 And no one, really, is listening to anyone else or getting what they want to say across properly. And Lauren just kept butting in and butting in and butting in because she knew what she was saying was completely, well, bullshit or very, very exaggerated or it could look like it was me or something. And it's, it was just so stressful. So here's my chance now on Reality Bite to my video vlog to get my points across that weren't shown or didn't, or I didn't get chance, if you know what I mean. Get it off your chest, Lise. Go on, look at those. I mean, why would I want to look at Lauren's boobs? I mean, you, you just wouldn't do that anyway. It's just a strange thing to say. Oh, chance of wanting to look at them, mamas. <laughs> Good job I've got a sense of humour, in it. Right, first of all, I've never once asked to see your boobs. We spoke about boobs because we've both had boob jobs done, and all girls do, all girlies have chats like that. Lauren, I walk around naked. Lauren walks around topless on the beach with a little skimpy thong on, quite happily in front of everyone, doesn't give a toss, so what? You can go topless. But what, what's this bit? I walk around naked. I've never walked around naked in front of Lauren. The only time was when I had my knickers on and she, we had some fake tan put on. And that, that was it, just for a few minutes while the fake tan dried. But I wasn't naked. But both topless on the beach anyway. Ooh, ooh. God, get a grip, woman. What else? I don't demand see it. I mean, it's just an A to avocados. They've gone up. Actually, actually chopped up her avocados and waited on her while she was in bed herself. Um, lazy woman. I was doing everything for her. So give me some credit, woman. She's such a diva. She's spoilt. Spoilt. That's what I say. Spoilt. Two of the avocados were squashy. You know, and you pick them up and squeeze them and they go... And all this brown crap came out of them. So I threw two away. The other two she had. Three. Anyhow, what's the big drama about the avocado? Anyhow, I just thought I'd get those points across. I feel a lot more calmer now. I feel better. So if, if there's anything else I can think of, because still my head's still going around in circles. This is such a drama. I mean, don't get me wrong, we had some fun while we was away. And she's, she is a funny woman. And she's, she is generous. She gave us some jewellery each and bought us little gifts and stuff. But just some of these stories she's coming out with. And it's, she's just like such a drama queen. You walk in a place. I mean, we're both, Lauren's six foot two, I'm six foot. Everybody stares at us. Everybody, wherever we go, just all, people just stop and stare. And I'm not just saying that. Anyone who's been with us will know what we're on about. And we're both loud. We're both um, strong characters, but we're both crazy and flamboyant and all of that so we walk in a restaurant and it'll be you know all this going on and you know everything's just becomes like a big drama all of a sudden and no matter what she's, and she's wiggling around and stuff which is quite funny i mean i do a bit of that anyway juggling juggling the boobies and it just starts kicking off over whether it's the, the olives or the avocado or if she's a vegetarian and there's tuna on her salad and she can't have tuna on the salad then goes and eats my pork sausage every day 
having for breakfast. Oh, right, I'm going. See ya.